are you screaming? everyone I haven't talked to you yet today excuse me while I look out the window it looks like our mowers just arrived go oh, look out yours yours is already open well it was I don't know what you did to it just let's go anyway we got up Jax was doing part of his schoolwork while I entertained Sebastian, then we went out to Dunkin' Donuts and had some breakfast because it is right next to a grocery store. We headed there. I don't normally go there, so I was a disaster just looking everywhere for all the things we needed. And we needed more than we normally do because we're gonna try some instant pot soup and we wanna make some pasta salad. So I was just like, oh, that took forever. We were exhausted. We came back and Sebastian had a snack. Jack's finished his schoolwork and now it is nap time. This little guy is going to play for five minutes, then he's going to choose his two books and we'll read them and have our nap time. And tonight is Taco Tuesday. Excuse my hair, I just put it up so it won't be all in the way. Piggy Wiggy is waiting for me to lay down. He gets stressed out until I get down. And then, yeah, we'll see you on the other side. having a little bit of a difficult evening here. I'm not sure what was going on. I tried to speak with Sebastian a few times. Oh, God. Oh, you, you missed. Look at your teeth, they're still blue. You gotta brush that all in. <laughs> brush it all in and then you're gonna spit, okay? And he was spitting and hitting, jumping on the chair at dinner. He did have only an hour nap, then he woke up, but I don't know. I kept asking him what was wrong, if there's anything he needed, what we could help him with spit into the sink. <coughs> now get your brush wet. Put it in your mouth. Suck that water. Clean, clean, clean. You can do it again. Oh yeah. And all he would do is like laugh hysterically and hit me, kick me, punch me, scream at the top of his lungs. So I had to just Hold him outside, and when we got home, we went up to bed. It is 6:42. We are getting ready to do our books, and hopefully start fresh tomorrow. Got the other child messaging me nonstop that he's stuck watching the dog or something. I don't know where my husband is, so I guess I need to message him back. But I gotta watch this guy, so. I'm going to say goodnight. Sorry there wasn't much for you, but yeah, I was still working a lot, so we'll see you tomorrow.